How's it going guys? My name is Graham and this is the demo for Other Her Loving Embrace, a adventure RPG game that is on Kickstarter right now. I'm going to have to be very timely with my upload of this because I want to make sure that people have the chance to go back this on Kickstarter if, if they're interested. This demo is like two to three hours, so I'm going to try and get through the whole thing hopefully before the campaign ends. At the time of recording this right now, there's like 16 days, so yeah, if you're interested at all, Get on it! Go check out the demo for yourself, and and uh, go go back the game. Support on Kickstarter. I'm very excited about this. The art style looks incredible. The characters look very unique. Uh, the setting is refreshing. I haven't actually really dug into the gameplay, but it all looks cool. Hi, my name's Gershom. I live in a really cool castle in a place called Chestertown. I really like drawing, reading, and playing outside. Although. I'm not really allowed to play outside anymore. But it's not my fault this time, I promise! Some mean spirits are causing lots of problems. This bee character, this frog, and then I don't know, a guy who has musical notes for a face? Messing with our crops, scaring animals, even attacking people. Spirits aren't all bad, but lots of them like to cause trouble. And Chestertown is attracting lots of bad ones lately. People are starting to get scared. Anyways, a couple of days ago I met a really cool traveler. He's a real wizard. He's got a plan to save the town and he wants me to be his assistant. He's really impressed by my magic, even though I don't practice a lot. Well, he didn't say he was impressed, but I can tell. Yeah, I'd be impressed if he didn't sleep in late. What? It's time to wake up, dummy. Oh, whoops. This guy with the bowl cut, I guess, is our main character. Ooh, I immediately like that soundtrack, though. Oh, it was just a dream. <laughs> Doesn't feel like I overslept at all. <sighs> I wonder where Mr. Wizard is. Maybe he's making breakfast? I should meet him outside. Arrows to move around, run by holding C. Ooh, I can create a little bubble to, like, kind of dash around using. Gershom and Mr. Wizard. He's level three. He's got a little bit, little bit of a leg up on us there. I got my cool bubble spell. Oh, okay. So I don't actually travel in the bubble. I just happen to be walking along beside it. I also have this little axe skill, and I can dash around. I'm gonna go not the way he recommended, and I'm gonna go explore what's going on down here. A mushroom, very nutritious, adds to HP and MP. A mushroom biscuit, very nutritious, adds even more. It's a book titled, So You Decided to Get Into a Battle, Volume 1. Should I read it? I'm I'm sure I'll figure out things as we go. I'll, or I, if I do read this, then I'll, I'll read it on my own time, not on camera. Uh, so right now, I only have the one spell, but I can I can learn additional spells to, to like equip and use. So right now, I just happen to have the bubble. All right, I'm sure we can just uh, get, a, get a move on things here. I don't need to get bogged down reading all those books. Oh, the like color and design of this, despite being like pretty basic looking pixel art, it still it has a very unique, distinct feel to it that's hard to quite put a finger on. Is he still sleeping? How do he manage to wake us up then? Oh, he talks in white like we do. I thought maybe he would have green text. I don't really know who woke us up. He's fast asleep, and after all his talk yesterday about an early start. Wake up, Mr. Wizard. What should I do? I should be polite. Kick him in the ribs. No, you don't want to rough up your teacher. Uh, hello? What? Oh, hey, kid. What is it, 10 o'clock already? Yes, yes, it is. What? Oh, man, I'm sorry. I was tuckered out. I better get up. <sighs> Are you kidding me? You went back to sleep? Well, now I'm going to go poke around with your stuff. The warmth of the fire sinks into your body and soul. HP and MP restored. Would you like to record your progress? Oh yeah, I can't be losing what I've got so far. I've come so far all on my own here. Oh, I can bust up barrels. I was just trying to interact with them to see what was going on. Fifteen monies of whatever kind that ends up being. Rupees or some such thing. Hmm, maybe I should go pick a fight without him. We'll see whether or not he wakes up. I really need you to get up. Wake up! 
Ugh. Uh. Ooh, spring to action. Okay, okay, I'm up. For real this time. Good morning. I'm ready for another day. You ready for another day of adventure? I am. I'm, I'm asking if you are. Uh, all we did yesterday was walk. Oh, Gershon. You lack vision. Greatness takes time, and no adventure starts without a bit of walking. Lucky for us, we're almost done with the walking part. Where are we walking to, by the way? Don't tell me you already forgot. It's all right here, in this book. With the stuff I learned in here, I've come with a foolproof plan. Not that book again. He's been so glued to it, he's barely said a word to me. Wait a minute, isn't that a library book? Ah, uh, yeah. I found it while doing some research. You're not supposed to take them out of the castle, did you ask? Whoa, me? Take something without asking? Gershom, I'm hurt. Of course I asked. Anyways, you asked about my plan? We're tracking down a source of magical energy called a lay point. The book says there should be one nearby if we head north. Oh, wow, that sounds really cool. I wonder what he wants a lay point for. Okay, class is over. We got lots to do, so let's head out. The wizard joins you. Ah, uh, there he is, written in green text there, so... Maybe when we aren't talking to each other directly is what... I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see how the green text pans out. Is he standing on top of his... I accidentally skipped that. He's too tired to take the lead. Ah, uh, he's, just, he's just trailing behind. That's fine. I think we need to head north. We might as well see what this is to the south first. Biscuit, rich and doughy. Oh, I'm, I'm getting a little bit of a drift in my... There you go. It goes away if I just... Uh, I think that's my joystick's fault, not the game's. And a quick little dummy. Did you want to practice fighting? Probably for the best. Oh, great. Sounds good. During practice, press start for instructions. Or if you want to quit. Oh, I was not expecting an actual 2D plane like this. Chop, chop, chop. Chop, chop, chop. Okay, the... the uh, battle format might be a little bit more involved than I was expecting. Like, it's, it's not a turn-based RPG the way that I thought. Oh, I can totally... I, I have, like, combos and stuff? It's like Mortal Kombat or, like, a fighting game or something. I, did I just do, like, a dash? down in the air oh or, or I can launch him up like that so I can downswing and then upswing to get some sick combos going there oh okay okay that's pretty fun actually charge and smash I should I should have my bubble thing as well shouldn't I as well maybe also C and B Char charge it up and then BAM oh big combo I don't entirely know how I did it there, oh, I, I, I hadn't quite filled, filled it up otherwise. Nice. Castle layout? Oh, okay, so this is, this is, uh, getting the Smash Bros experience of testing the different, different possible things going on. Oh, sick. I can also fight as Mr. Wizard. Bam, bam, bam. What, what kind of sick moves you got, Mr. Wizard? Presumably you got, like, a lifting move, uh, a similar launching move. A, a charge and dash thing. I should try and fully charge up. Bam! Oh, that was like a lightning blast or like an arrow blast. Like, can I do that? Like, oh, I, I wasn't sure if you would do it in the air. But now it's got me thinking because I bet I can do stuff like. Ba -ba! See, that's really fun. That's totally awesome. All right, exit training. That's very cool and. Not at all what I expected from the fighting mechanics in this game. So apparently I I got a bit to learn here. It doesn't... It's not quite the genre of game I thought it was. And I'm very okay with this. Because, like... We could use a shake-up. And in, in the slew of, like, Undertale clones or Final Fantasy likes or whatever, this feels new. Pressing the assigned B key will cast a currently equipped spell. Yes! Explore creative ways. Try and try and make use of uh, my different stuff. Not quite what I need. There's a beam of light coming from the block. Now, bet it's using the lay point as a power source. It has a switch on it. I wonder what it does. I would like to. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now bubble that across, and then hammer it across. Ooh, it created a weird like jelly. 
And I could wrap up the jelly and then hit it across. That felt like Zelda. The little fanfare jingle that it just did. Can I jump? Can I jump a little gap there? Not quite. Hold your horses. Our first real battle. See that shadowy thing up ahead? That's a spirit. Wow. I thought they'd look more ghostly. The book said that it's hard for them to stay in spirit form while in our world. Listen, we're gonna fight a lot of these things on our trip. If you don't feel ready, you should definitely go back to camp and train. It also wouldn't hurt to look at some of the books in the cabin's basements. Good idea. Nah, I'm ready. I've read some of the books. Uh, I've read enough of them. <laughs> come, come, come back here. There you go. First strike. The enemy is caught off guard. Oh, okay, so this, oof, this is a different battle format? Or do I have to do a turn-based battle to initiate more of an actual battle? Here I come. Five. Oh, oh god. Okay. Holy shit. It goes into like a little Smash Bros battle? Did I take damage there like a lot? The enemy regains composure. Fight. I'm going to enjoy this. Ah, so he totally is the uh, the green text. No, that's something that's something piling up. That's totally separate from the HP and MP. The enemy attacks the wizard. Okay. Oh god. Okay, this is a little bit undertale y though cuz there's like different attack patterns and stuff that you got to learn to deal with. This is the most creative, most interesting seeming uh, battle system I've ever seen. This is so damn cool. Ah, ah, okay, different level layouts and stuff. God, all right, but I'm totally getting crushed right now because I, I got to figure this out a little bit. Maybe a little too overzealous, just thinking, thinking I was totally ready for it. Brash, plus four, damage 17, hit five. But, okay, oh, I managed to like jump rope it or something. I don't really know how I quite avoided that. Shit. All right, I gotta finish this thing off. Charge up. Big finishing move. The party is victorious. But I got real messed up along the way. Everyone is not in good shape. I'm gonna keep an eye out for a new campfire. Awesome, perfect. The warmth of the fire sinks into your body and soul. HP and MP. Restored. Okay. I nurse joyed it. That was the neatest, craziest shit. I just picked up and tossed a bush. So uh, there's a large variety of things that can be shoved with the, the balloon ability, it would seem. Hey, wrong way. The book said the temple was north. I'm just trying to explore, man. I'm trying to see what's out there. That came back. I kind of thought that might be the case. So I'm going to try and duck past it to go see what's going on up here. Mm, I do still want to fight this. Just to see. It's another low gust buzzing in. Get ready to lose. I don't think it can do... Like, I don't think it attacks me in these little screens. It's all about me trying to output damage. And the enemy is striking at me. I got an ace there. Damage 64. It's, I got 14 hits, I think, is what it's saying there, which seems really damn good to me. Shit. I don't quite know entirely how to dodge that. I, I gotta I gotta figure it out. Big mistake, buddy. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> oh, I, I was comboing with, with not actually pointing at him there. That was very poorly done. Oop. Okay, okay, okay. If I end up between those two green lines there. I, I think I'm safe there. I think that's like my escape when I jump through that is how I avoid getting hit. The party is victorious. Those battles are exhilarating. It's very exciting. I can't wait to play around with it more. Alright. Very fun, interesting little dungeon groove going on here. Hmm. No. Not... I feel like I gotta, I gotta make it to the other side. I'm gonna go up and down again to see if I can reset that, maybe? Because there's a chance that I was supposed to do something like this. See, that's not gonna make it through to the other side. I can't, I can't shoot bubbles past that or anything, so I can't do anything from this side. Presumably that'll become, like, a shortcut for me after I do the necessary activation from the other side. Doesn't matter if I take a quick heal, they'll bring back these enemies. 
but it's enemies I haven't fought yet anyways. I don't know how worth it it is to always fight, like, everything. Uh, I, I have levels, so it makes me think that I must have experience to gain. Okay, he has the multiple different attack types too, which is very cool. And wizard. Alright, I haven't done very well in my previous attempts to, to land crazy awesome combos against him with, with Mr. Wizard. I don't seem to do particularly well with that. Oh god, okay, I, I, I there, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to fall down through there. Huh, <sighs> gonna avoid that swarm. I'm gonna whack him with my axe. That's a, that's a rock solid plan. I like that plan. Party's victorious. I'm gonna try and scope out your guys' like stats. Oh, maybe that's experience. That would make sense, I think. Uh, equipment? Right now I have Brandish, use your axe to spin in circles, and Sky Chase. These are like my, my ultimates then, I guess, that I've, that I've been using. Uh, those are both sound good to me. Not in demo, not in demo. Abilities, I only have the one right now. Punch and boast. Uh, and that's, that's all, that's all good. Well and good. Raking in a lot of cash, busting up all this stuff. Oh, first strike, yeah. You gotta remember to swing the axe at them when, when I run at them, rather than simply just, like, meeting up like that. Oh, come on, I, yeah, 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 those big uppercuts is what I'm going for. Not quite the best I've done. Enemy regains composure, but if I get these two, uh, attacks like that in combination there, oh. I feel like I must have been so close to getting getting the, the finishing blow in there. Damn it, that went terribly. Shit. <laughs> I haven't quite figured that out yet. Oh, Kogo dropped right on his head. It's tough to run up and down those hills. They zigzag you if you don't plan ahead. I do that every time I exit battle, because using your axe in battle is X on the joystick and A in the overworld, so I keep I keep getting it wrong when I make the, the switch. I forgot to attack him. The Barbaribro. Barbaribro Jr. slinks in. This is what there was a picture of in the, in the series of drawings, that, now that I think about it. Uh, it. It does not have musical notes in its head. I don't really know what it had going on there. Try and try and get some uppercut in action there. Toss him up in the air. Oh god. Okay. He's uh, he's using my axes against me here. And talk smack. Get whacked. I should I should probably charge up. Maybe I left it too long. Damn it. That was not worth it. Was not a good move. Whoop. Oh, I wasn't expecting him to slow down and go back like that. Wow. Wizard is knocked unconscious. Learning, learning some of these different uh, attack patterns and stuff is quite tricky. Damn it, I blew that. Oh, and you gotta charge that up to use your special. Well, now it's all on you, Gershom. You silly named child. <laughs> so attacking fills things up, and then you can totally fill it up uh, by, by specifically charging it. But it seems like your best bet is to do a combination of both. So land a, a combo of attacks, charge it up as much as you can. Oh, I almost didn't make that jump, and I was a little worried about that. <laughs> yeah. Charge up through attacking, and then, so not every individual battle that you just spend charging things up a bunch. See there, I kind of ran at him and, and charged it up a little bit while I was... You can do a nice combination. There's a cool way that you can kind of split your focus there. I really dig that. Uh, I'm guessing he's still fainted, yeah. So I'll probably run back. Invigora, good good for health. Can I hop down on the log? No, not quite. That's what I'm talking about with the bubble. I always use the bubble when I shouldn't. I, I need to run back and heal up before I carry on that way then. Too risky. I probably want to have both guys. So they're not all of the attacks going against Gershom all on his own. Uh, it's leaving the area that revives creatures, not specifically activating a campfire. So I kind of have a freedom to, to scoot on out of here again. I uh, didn't have to actually fight any of that. I want to know the stats of you guys, then I want to know how close you are to leveling up potentially. Physical health, don't run out, amount of MP used for battle skills. Physical damage from Gershom's attacks. Magical damage from his skills. Effect drop rate, prices, and more. Alright, pretty full set of stats. 
Uh, I don't see anything that has to do with actually leveling up. I'm curious to see how that comes into the story then, if it doesn't work quite as I thought. It feels like this is going to be a series of, of motions that need to be made here. So that first instinct was incorrect. I can move him across. Hmm, I'm starting to see a little bit... No, that's not quite it either. Now that's totally stuck in the corner. I don't think I can get that out of there. Oh, no, no, no. I got... I was I was looking through things the opposite direction. Damn it. Oh, okay. Reset. <laughs> I had the right idea a, a minute ago. But I, I was trying to make the wrong one of these do the wrong thing. And there again, that was stupid. Uh, just reset. So that can stay there now that it's been slid across. And I'm going to chuck you guys around again. There. Overcomplicated it on my uh, other attempt there. I dig it. I dig the puzzle potential that we got going on here. See, this is seeming a bit wrong already. But this is just for my one skill. There are other skills in the game, too, that could potentially uh, introduce other puzzle mechanics. There's no way that's anything. My, my first instinct, then, is going to be to kick that out of the way. Mm, nah, I don't really know what I'm building towards with that. Okay. I slid, I slid them both into this middle one so that I could get to this point. Not that. Just like that. Oh, okay, yes. Yeah, that worked. I was thinking I needed the, the third one for the final step of that. All right. All right. I'm getting the hang of that. Always be aware of your surroundings. Look around you for secrets whenever you can. Mmm, I do love when a game has secrets to go digging for. Red ring, very charming. Extra body and luck. Well, I think we go ahead and equip that to one of you boys then. As soon as I discover how. Equipment. To Gershom? Ah, you only have space for one. You have space for one, like, special skill and space for one uh, item addition. Now I'm, now I'm going to go run into every tiny weird looking part of the forest for the rest of time in like some hopes that uh, I'm going to very specifically find like <laughs> extra equipment and everything like that. I'm sure the game has lots to find, but for the next like foreseeable little bit of the game there I'm going to feel so like absurdly extra committed to that little hunt, much more so than I need be. That comboing was much better than I've I've ever maybe done. Woo, woo. Okay, getting the feel for things there. But yeah, I I uh, with Mr. Wizard there. I don't think I've ever done damage that strong. I was doing like tens and stuff there once or twice. That was much more effective than the previous time. Level up. Oh, I, there's experience. I totally have experience, and I can track experience there. It makes sense. It was just distracting because those bars are the same color as like the power-up bars that happen when you're in in the battle here. So that's kind of what I was in my mind picturing, I guess. But not at all what 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 it actually was. Striking at Gershom. See this one. Th ah, I can't quite make it into the levels that I want to. Keep taking damage on that one. But I do like that I can focus on all offense and all defense. I'm not trying to dodge things that attack them all in some crazy, difficult-to-manage combination of things. Oh, I still got it if I won it. I thought I was going to finally make it through that one without anything. I don't see that enemy's health anywhere on the screen. I wish there was some small way to, to showcase uh, enemy health. It seems like that would be appreciated and, and helpful for me. Ooh, new area, new soundtrack, mixing things up. Sounds like a jam. Is he gonna say no go? Okay, he's okay with me doing a, li a little bit of a detour here. We can go check out this little tent. Mushroom, uh, nutritious, another mushroom, and a couple pots that I just, uh, I'm not a big fan of. Are you, do you have other things you wanna teach me? Did you wanna practice fighting? Nah, I, I think I think I've got a good enough feel for it. I feel like the battles aren't too stressful, and it's 
it's fine to practice in battle. I'm okay with that. I, I imagine the more we take on, the better it's going to come together. We've already... That's got to... That's going to become easier to navigate out of. I keep accidentally sticking that menu every single time because I'm just spamming through it. I don't like that. That looks like something I can walk through. Nah. Just a... Just a nothing gap in the trees. Oh, hey! Customers! Nice to meet you! I'm Ruby. I dig these, like, cutscenes with additional like well done artwork and everything like that. I hike around looking for stuff to sell and people to buy. Take a look around. Give me a holler if you see something you want. I added the word around. Same same meaning. Just uh don't tell anybody you got it from me. Oh, she's a fence. Look, and Vigora tastes like strawberries. But they work well enough. You make it sound like tasting like strawberries is a bad thing. Fo focoid it's supposed to help with concentration, but it gives me a headache. And the mushroom biscuit thing. I made this myself from locally sourced ingredients. You can buy one if you want, although you might not like it. I don't actually need anything at the moment. I could potentially sell something? I think that's the extent of what I'm allowed to carry. Like, uh, it seems like I'm, I can only have whatever that is, 10 items so I, I might as well sell a couple things uh, I don't know you guys at all <laughs> no desire to chat with a couple of strangers it's okay I see how it is all right we'll go on a bit a bit more of a, an adventure here we I'm not quite feeling adventured out uh, I thought maybe I could hug the hug the wall there just a little bit instead I'm just gonna go bash every bush there ever was and we've maybe found the first, like, temple? I didn't know if the game was split into temples. Hmm. The Solastron Outpost. That's some intense ass music. <laughs> okay. Uh, not what I was anticipating, but I guess maybe now I give it a try since I'm here anyways. This place is huge. I bet there's lots of treasure hidden somewhere. Wouldn't that be something? I know you're excited, but we need to be careful. Looks like there's already spirits here, and there could be traps. So be on your best behavior, okay? Don't go running off. Alright, I promise. I got it. Don't you worry about it. This frog isn't gonna know what hit it. It's a little too close. I always I keep forgetting to actually attack them. Oh, we're we're getting different layouts that we have to worry about. Oh, and this guy actually like runs from you a little bit. That dastard. He strikes at Gershom. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Now I gotta learn different attack patterns. Ah! That was not difficult at all. It's just a matter of learning it. You get back here. I can't double jump. You're very difficult to track down when you jump around like a crazy like that. He attacks the wizard. Okay. Damn it. I know what I'm doing. I'm still getting wrecked on that one. This should not be a difficult enemy, I don't think. I'm trying to, I'm trying to look carefully at, like to see if there's anywhere on the screen that's showing me specifically how much life he has left. Don't get too close to the wall, because it bounces back pretty quickly from the wall there, so I don't want don't want that stacking up against me. That was decent comboing. I don't, I don't know what's about to happen. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright. Uh, wizard, not holding up too well. Kind of kind of letting me get the better of me on that one. Party's victorious. Might need to go chugging down a mushroom or something, though. The HP boost is what I need. The biscuit. You better use the biscuit. Don't don't need any of the other stuff just yet. Little toggle. All right. Easy does it. Oh, even easier than I thought. I don't even need the bubble skill or anything. I literally just push it and it's good. Looks like this slab has been here for a long time. No trespassing by decree of the Grand Orthodoxy. This site is historically significant and extremely dangerous. Violators will be punished to the maximum extent of the law. Sounds pretty serious. That's ah, just a suggestion. Keep going. <laughs> what a good influence he's uh, turning out to be, eh? Mushroom biscuit, very useful. Glad to have it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get the first strike. Damn it! <laughs> he got the first strike. 
The enemy is caught off guard. Oh, I had my axe out, so it still counted it, even though I didn't seem to actually be pointing it at this thing. That's fine. I'll take it. Oh, nice. I can, even when I don't land it, I can use the uppercut attack as, like, a, a, a double jump. Kind of like uh, using, like, an up A or whatever from the Smash Bros, actually. So it, it really does have a strong, interesting Smash Bros feel to it. I don't know how to avoid that. Oh, the... His rope was like sh shining in and out of focus or whatever there to showcase that it was not. Uh, ah, yes, managed to finish him off. That it was not going to hurt me. That I could jump through that. There's a little bit of a visual indicator there. I just kind of have to learn the language of the game a little bit more. Uh, since I since I'm still new to it, I don't know the vocabulary of what is and isn't something that you can you can go through. You know. I do want to see if it lets me... Nah, I still can't world map, even even when I'm in a dungeon where it seems like a map would maybe be more useful, less useful overall. It's something. I, I, I just figured it would allow it. Now we're getting back into the bubble requirements. I'm guessing this is a pretty short dungeon. I also just realized that a gem dropped there and luckily it stays when you move from from one room to the next. So far, healthy combination of battling and puzzling. I'm into that. Nope. <laughs> That's all that took. Now, now I can uh, redo that same little combo. The little one, two that I... Oh, it reset everything. How foolish of me and the game. I would like to spread equal blame in this particular situation. Jeez, there we go. Huh, shouldn't have been so hard. Do you know why all these switches are here? Duh, it's for security to stop people from getting in, right? Oh, yeah, sorry, that was a dumb question. Hey, uh, great work so far, Gershom. I can see a place to rest in the room ahead if you're getting tired. Thank you. Thank you for not being a total dick about it. I'm trying my hardest here. Glad you could recognize it. The barracks. I'll rest when I'm dead. Right now, <laughs> I want to go busting up different enemies. Seems like a, a much more effective use of my time. Oh, that was some sick comboing until, you know, until I dropped off the map. Oh, well, okay. No, I don't know what to do. That's different. The, because I'm in the dungeon now, that looks different than it did when we were in like the forest. That's cool that like the environments or whatever that these little battles and defenses are taking place in are changing. But it also threw me off a little bit because I oh I didn't mean to air dash. Didn't even know how I did that really. Uh, but yeah, that messed me up. Took a lot more damage than I needed to then, seeing as how that is suddenly just over. Well, you said this was a restroom, right? Oh my gosh. Ugh. Uh, what happened here? Hey, are you okay, Mr. Wizard? Yeah, of course I'm fine. You stay right there. Don't move an inch. Mm, these skeletons, these weren't simple deaths. These were brutal, vicious killings. We're in the barracks, so I think it's safe to say that these were guards. Somebody really had it out for these guys. Looks like it was a team effort, too. Well, it's no tropical resort, but this room seems safe enough. The spirits seem to be avoiding here, too. Let's not stay here any longer than we have to. I think there is where I'm going to save things. I don't know how long this dungeon's, dungeon's going to be, and if the demo is like three hours or whatever, we can do nice, like, half hour-ish episodes, sprinkle things out a little bit. I'm into it. This is like, the art is beautiful. I love all the contrasting colors and everything. The combination of like Smash Bros fighting and turn-based gameplay is awesome. The fact that you balance offense and defense in different like turns like that. The characters seem okay so far. I'm curious to learn more about it. The, the art when you go with the shop and everything. I love so much about this that I am so eager to see more. I hope you guys are into it as well, too. 
if this is a type of game that you enjoy, I'm going to stick a couple uh, end card playlists at the end for Heartbound and Horror Veil. How about that? I feel like those would be good ones that, that people would be interested in if they like this type of game. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon. Remember, you can go download the free demo for yourself, and the Kickstarter campaign is running now, so link down below. Go check that out for yourself.